start throwing out your predictions here in chat. Fight. But it will be Lagmaster or Juker. Will it be the Will it be the Terminator or the Wing Chun Master? You're poking away. Putting Marduk on the floor. Oh no, no punish there on the FCDF2. Again, that is mid high. Uh, the DF4 1 plus DF4 2, right? Not DF4 1 plus 2. Okay, comment. As per usual. As both players battle it out here in the and uh, in the fourth set of the 25th edition of Dojang Exhibitions. Oh my goodness, running on galore. Look at the execution. That's what I'm gonna do also when I play Lydian Road to Blue Cheese. I'm gonna be spamming spam, spamming running one. FF3 guaranteed. Heaven and Earth! And that hurts a ton for two slices of red cheese. Round three. Fight. Okay, if I'm supposed to match it by skill level, that would be HG versus Waffle. And then Eric versus. Duckbird. Okay, so that, that closes out the walk in this. So that means that's six sets for tonight. He's a keyboard warrior. Fight. <laughs> they playing on keyboard? Or do you mean something else? <laughs> uh-huh. Big plus frames on that F44. Yeah, Marduk known for stealing rounds, but not at that moment. Lag now without it. We shall see how it will be. More room for Juker to breathe. And big counter hit. For Lagmaster. Laying down the pain right here. There's no walls, but I'm gonna keep chasing you down non-stop. A forward one, two. They're throwing out strings right now. They got the mid version of the DF4. Really not letting, really not letting Juker go. But that could be it. That Rage Art could spell the end of this round. Not the game, but the round. No, it is not over yet. That plus 5 HP buff in Season 4. It's just shoulder. I believe FF3 was the punish there. To flip over Marduk. And if not FF3, uh, down back 3 could be enough. Fantastic duck. That's what happens when you are willing to terminate. You know the opponent's moveset A to Z. There you go. Spacing out right now. But Lagmaster really wants to be in Juker's face right now. Round three. Fight. We'll see how Juker's going to adjust to this this offense. I mean, it's it's operating on a different ping. Again, it is Lagmaster. So if you're at five ping, Lagmaster is probably at 10, 15, 225. I don't know. It's definitely not going to be on the same page, that's for sure. Well, I mean, while the connection is five bars, the, 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 other, the other connection, right, of like the information gathering, all that kind of jazz, different. Oh, there you go, the tackle. Guess is right, it's still alive. <gasps> Almost got that punish. Big plus frames. Oh, that was definitely great for Lagmaster. Five slices of cheese going to go his way from the cheese buffet. Oh, alas, that is not negative 13. That is a safe low at negative 12. Because Marduk is DLC. It is what it is. Woohoo! Just testing the throw breaks non stop. Eventually, it will go in. And Juker got it. After many, many attempts. Final round. Fight. 
Mm -hmm. I believe that is a punishable power crush. There you go, Juker able to keep up the pace of Lagmaster right now. It's like, okay, you're in a different ping. Don't worry, I'll just change my frequency. Like on the radio. Just keep, you keep changing it until you find it. There you go, testing Lagmaster's throw breaks once more. Another throw. Guess right? No guess. Again, it's a 25-25 mix-up. And that's two games, right? Yep. So I'll be closing the poll in just a bit. I'll close the poll when the... third game commences. Why is Duckbird a top fan? I don't know, man. The... The cheese gods have decided. They don't want to make you a top fan. It is what it is. <laughs> I have zero control over that. I can't just give a random person a badge. I can't. Like any viewer, there's no there's no setting that allows me to just give a badge. It's not like Twitch where you can make someone a VIP. I could make someone a mod, yeah, that I could do. Maybe if you get a lot of counter hits and always channel Steve Fox, I'll do it. Woo! Denying the rage drive and it start off frames of back forward too. That's something like Brian's map punch, except the input's a little bit different. Brian's is FF2, while Alisa's is back forward 2. Oh, even on the back page, I'm a top fan. Yeah, but Chester, even on his own page, is not a top fan, right? It'd be... Fantastic duck on the 1-1. Here you go, gets the launch. The wall is right there, overshoots it a little bit. That was fully charged, or slightly charged. So it shouldn't be that negative if it's slightly charged. Running two to keep him in place. Hey, we catch his Juker pressing buttons there. After down back three. That is negative one on hit. So if you press a jab, you'll always beat up the wall standing four. But if Alisa presses a down jab, then that's when your jab will lose. Because again, it does high crush. Hey, you guess it's on the 50-50 there. For King, Armored King, and Marduk, the grounded throws. They are basically the same. It's either a 1 or a 2 every single time. There you go, Marda clearly learned from the Wing Chun Master. <laughs> Around the world we go, but drops it. Salvaging the combo with the mount. And on point is Lagmaster. Ops not to continue the whole boot string. They're just testing the throw breaks over and over again. Exactly. Even in my own page, it's him not a top fan. Well, my account's not a top fan in my own page. Because I don't interact with it at all. Mm -hmm. Indeed. But the Destro stance. Out now for Lagmaster. Going in. Not stopping. Sidewall saving lives. They go plus four into Destro. Is it plus four? I forget. But I know it's plus. Boom. <laughs> Maybe in my page you'll be a top fan. There you go. Duckbird. Keep sharing the strats right now. Maybe, perhaps. Maybe that's the secret. RB Norway. RB Norway. Second seven frames. Yeah, raffles and giveaways. There you go. Since the bot is working differently right now. It is what it is. Uh-huh, 33 seconds left on the clock. And Lagmaster looking to get that game back! Back forward to yet again, denying the rage drive. 3-1-1 to 56. Juker fired the 3-digit club, while Lagmaster fired the 2-digit club. No 10% damage buff here, none, none at all. Yeah, low, looking for that Okizeme. And sniffs out that low. The get-up low that would, you know, go to mount. Wall splat. Around the world. Go to my page as well. You'll become a top fan here. I love you. <laughs> 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 
by Arbinoe, Alisa. I'm looking for FC DF1 plus 2. There you go. Hello. Full crouch. DF1 plus 2. It's plus 5 to plus 7. So if you enter Destro, it's both... Uh, whether you enter as Destruction Stance or not, it's always plus 5 to plus 7. Alright. All right, down back one's SBT. Customs galore. It is going to be the Burr month soon, after all. Yes, Lagmaster already has his custom on board. Once the Burr months come in, September will be the start of it. <laughs> oh, beautiful! Hop kick with punish. That's something you gotta have on deck if you're ready to terminate. Punishment for days as it, as it can anchor you. There you go again. Knows the strings of Marduk. Not letting him go. He's like, you stay there. You stay in place. Round two. Fight. Mm-hmm. Alright, noted. So every time I do down three. Do SBT. Four. Assuming I got that right. Lamet's a top fan, there you go. Almost got that combo. Another whiff punish! That was a little... That was actually... I didn't expect that range to... I didn't even expect 2-4 to connect there. The range on that. Insane! Keeping Juker in place yet again. And yeah, probably change this ping, change this frequency. They have to scroll down again. To find... The exact ping Lagmaster's on right now. Oh, QCF2 just whiffing out there. The stronger end mill between Marduk and Gigas. Because Gigas is down back to his negative 14 on Blanc, while Marduk's is negative 12. Low galore right now. Running two. Good break. On the generic throw. We'll let the drive go out there. 25 seconds and just patiently waiting against the get up kick for that punish. Woo! Is that okay? Looks like Juker found the frequency already. That was quite fast. Oh, you're on this one, right? You're on the 57 ping. On a frequency of 250 point something hertz. <laughs> there you go. Heavy Link ready to become a top fan over at Duckbird. 1 plus 2, no break. Continuously going for it. And of course, a guaranteed follow up. Oh, the secret whiff sauce. Trying to see if Soya Bean Curd's secret sauce was effective there, but not against Juker. 50 50 guess, one or a two. Goes for the tackle. Gotta guess again, it doesn't end. Oh, and a reverse sweep there. What a comeback from Juker. Found the frequency of Lagmaster, and he's like, okay, now I know the. No, I don't think so. I'm not sure if anyone has. Because you'd have to pay to trademark something, right? Or copyright it. That way no one else can use it, or if someone else uses it, they have to pay you. Or like, get a license. I don't think anyone has. Ooh. The punishment almost on point there. Couch cancel jam. Looking for that plus 8 frame advantage. Again, frames are a state of mind. You can still challenge at negative 9, that's your choice. There you go. Knows the mid-high strings. There you go, but the cameraman, not too kind. They swap sides, and Lagmas is gonna take full advantage of it. Swapping again! That is definitely perfect. Round three. Fight. Awarded seven slices of cheese there. However, Juker not to be outdone. Testing Lagmas' throw breaks till the end of time. 1-1 one, one into Destro immediately. Oh, that is a trade not in favor of Lagmaster. The wall is right over there. Overshoots it though. But the Okizeme on point. Round four. BTS 1. Fight. 
Oh, that works. Okay, noted. I'm gonna put that in my notes right now. Time to hit BF1 4 into down back 4. Alright. So, what I usually do is just down back 3 on hit. I'm like, yeah, put it in. Or down 4. Down 1 plus 2, channeling in the inner Horang, that on point power crush. Final round. Moving to the final round. It looks like Lagmaster was able to maximize that time to think of an adjustment. Ooh, big Okizemi there. But you like, gonna test my throw breaks? Say no more. That is a 1 plus 2 break there. Well, all of Elisa's command throws are 1 plus 2. Mm -hmm. Only gonna take one hit. Gets the rage. Ooh, plus 8! Oh, and another trade not in favor of Lagmaster. One of them's wearing out, so I'm probably gonna open my small little box in my room to get like the, the backup pieces, the backup parts for my two buttons. My two buttons are really soft right now. Like it's not, it's too sensitive in terms of like when you just graze it. Unlike the other buttons, the one, two, and three. Then again, I can probably just use the same Mitsus on the side. Move it as the main button. It's all good, it's all good, it's all good. You're able to fix it. That's what matters more. Ooh, did you press a button? You did. There you go, lag master. Changing the frequency right now. Okay, you can't, you can't let Juker. You have to keep changing the frequency every round. Is it, if you, even if you just change it once, Juker's able to adjust. It's like, okay, you're on this frequency, right? He's able to guess it easily. You have to just keep changing it over and over again. Different adjustment, different adjustment, different style, different uh, uh, different options. That's a little bit chaotic in a sense. Because <laughs> you have to keep changing it up, so you might eventually start mixing yourself up. KO. Round three. Fight. So we'll see, this is a familiar situation for Juker last game. Last game or last last game? One of the two. Where you got a reverse sweep. Against Lagmaster. I don't believe that's 12 frames. Right? That's 13 frames. Yeah. And that low is negative 12 on block. So while standing for is probably the best Elisa's getting. Or a crouch cancel 1-1. One, one. Oh no, but uh, QCF2 recovers crouching somewhat. Yeah, you don't want to walk into that. Let's see if Juker can close it out here. Does that connect? Oh, it does not. Back forward to yet again. Denying rage drives and denying big wall stage. Indeed. You heard Marduk. The question is for who? As Lag Master is able to sniff up the get up. The mount option. Like you're gonna go low, right? You want it. Ego reduces the damage there. And there's Destro for free. Again, 1-1 one, one is mid-high. A high-high. It's not jail. I'm blocked. And two slices of che red cheese going lag master's way from the cheese buffet. Again, A open from 8 to 11 in the evening, Philippine time. We're still refilling all the cheese, so... Take as many plates as you like. Oh my goodness, low galore! Truly changing up the frequency right now. Each round is completely different. It's gonna be hard to keep track of. Like, okay, last round you did it like this, and then the other round was completely different, right? But of course, that wouldn't matter if you get your offense in. You don't have to worry about it. But if the life is quite even, you're gonna have to start worrying about it. You have to keep track. Oh no, entering Destro once more. Interrupting it. It's like, I had enough. FF3-2. Quite close to the wall, but they get up avoiding QCF2. Ooh, wants something different right now. Really changing it up. Simple and clean for Juker. Don't think twice. Dun, 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 dun. When's Kingdom Hearts 4? Malaya Pana. Back to 4 overshooting it, but just wants to keep Juker at the wall. Wanted that damage. Resetting the position. Mid check. 
Mid check. Oh, more mids galore. Proving the audience predictions nine. wrong right now. It shall be Ganryu. We'll see if there are similarities or not. Round one. Fight. So do you play it safe? Do you gather information in the first round, or you just do you just keep going strong from the last two games? What is the game plan for Lagmaster? Full string, fantastic punish. Here we go, the Destro. We've seen this before. It doesn't end. Mango trying to get out of that rage drive in a dream here for Juker. Oh, but down back one. Just avoiding the high. Gets the one round lead. Hop kick for days. Lagmaster constantly changing frequencies. And the ping. But Juker not to be outdone. FC DF2. Oh, steps on DF3. I think that's only Elisa. Or characters with great movement, because after DF3 for Horang, if you if you get hit by it by Ganyu, you're just stuck in place. There's nothing you can do. <laughs> it's such a strong low. Yes, simple and clean. Simple is best sometimes, but right now, Lagmaster mixing it up with many kinds of cheese. There you go, DF3. Non-stop galore right now. Juker also ready for Rev Major, doing it three times in a row. There's the side wall, the side wall's there. Still keeps Juker alive. Rage drive in the dream. Full string. Low parry. <gasps> oh my goodness. And that's five slices of great cheese for Lagmaster. One more round away. I'm taking the W here in Dojang Exhibitions. Also wants to catch up to Musebee's 14 wins. The wall splat. Almost catches the tech there with full crouch F1 plus 2. Or while standing 1 plus 2. It doesn't end. Stuck at the corner with nowhere to go. And Lagmaster taking it 5 to 4. And good games to both players. Good games.